Front controller is a popular UI design pattern that is used by web applications. From this lecture, you will learn what it is, why we need it, and how it works. When we build web applications, we typically handle non-functional requirements like security, internationalization, and so on. If our request handling piece, when the request comes from the client's browser, if that piece is not in one single place, then we'll have to repeat this code which handles the security and internationalization across the request handling port. That is exactly where the friend controller pattern comes in and it uses the handler class to centralize the entire request handling. This handler will handle the HTTP GET and POST methods. It will pull the URL and URI information and the request information, all the request information that comes in the HTTP request and then it will call into a command class. There can be multiple command classes. For example, in this stock application, we have a login command, then we have a sell stocks command class and then a buy stocks command class. All these implement or extend this abstract command. So the responsibility of the handler is to simply pull the URL information from the URL on the URI information, it will identify which command can handle a particular incoming request and it will call into the appropriate command. From that point, it is the responsibility of this command class to do all the logic, call into other classes if required and then at the end of it, return a view. So the next view, is the responsibility of the command and not the responsibility of the handler. The mapping of this URL or URI to a particular command class can be done statically or dynamically. That is, we can have a lot of if-else blocks. If the URL is this, call the particular command and so on. Or we can put a mapping file by mapping different URLs to different classes instead inside a property file or a XML file, making our job a lot more easier. Both of these approaches have their own advantages. In the static approach, we are making sure at compile time that all the URLs are mapped to a particular command class for sure. Whereas in dynamic approach, the advantage is that the maintenance becomes easy. We need not search for where a particular command class is for a particular URI, everything is centralized into one file and also we can dynamically add new commands into this property file without changing or compiling the code. In this case, we'll have to change this if else logic or add a new else block. The command pattern also has a variation wherein it can use a dispatcher instead of the handler class handling everything and calling the command class, the handler class can simply pull the HTTP information and then it calls into a dispatcher handing it over the HTTP information. This dispatcher is responsible for calling the appropriate command class. So this is splitting the responsibility here. Finally, in the MVC pattern, the friend controller can be used for the controller. So you usually see that Whenever there is an MVC pattern implemented for a web application, the controller piece can be a friend controller pattern. So to summarize, a friend controller pattern makes sure that all the request handling code is in one single place, which allows us to decorate it or come up with non-functional requirements like security and internationalization in one single place instead of repeating them. The handler typically calls into commands each command is responsible for doing a particular work. This mapping of URI to command can be static or dynamic. The responsibility of the handler is only to pull the request information and call the command. The command is responsible for handling the request by calling into other classes and then returning the next view that should be displayed to the end user. In the Java EE world, typically the handler and the dispatcher are servlets and the commands are normal Java classes. And the variation, as you have seen, we can use a variation wherein we can have a dispatcher along with the handler. And also in the MVC pattern, you will see that in some cases, they use the friend controller pattern to implement the CPs.